Hello. Today I will be showing you how to install and run Windows games and programs in Linux. For this tutorial I will be using Ubuntu Mate, version 18.04. The first step is to open the Software Boutique. If you are using Ubuntu, you'll have to open the Ubuntu Software Center, or Software Center, for short. From here, look to install Play on Linux. For me it is in the Game category. If you are using a different distro, just search for the words Play on Linux in your local toolbar. Once that's done, look to install the Synaptic Package Manager. With both programs installed, you are going to launch the Synaptic Package Manager. In Synaptic, in its search bar, type in the word Y, and click on Search. In the results, be sure to check all the boxes that I'm checking. If you want to make sure that you are installing all the packages that are required, feel free to pause the video and double check that you have selected the correct packages. As I scroll up, you have a second chance to see all the programs that need to be installed. Once done, please select Apply. Let it download and install. When the install is over, click on Close, and exit out of Synaptic. Open up Play on Linux. If you get this pop-up click on No. When Play on Linux opens click on Install Program. Click on Install an unlisted program that is located on the bottom left of the window. In the window that pops up, click on Next. Next again. Next again. And next once more. Here you are going to give a name to the program, or game you want to install. Click on Next. Next, again. Choose if it's a 32-bit, or 64-bit, install. I recommend choosing 32-bit because of compatibility issues. Let Wine Launch, click on Browse, and locate the EXE of the program you wish to install. For this tutorial I'll be installing an old classic game called Delaware St. John. 
Curse of Midnight Manor. With the EXE selected, click on Next. Run the install of your program. When finished, you will be brought back to play on Linux. Here you will be asked to create a shortcut for the program you've just installed. I would recommend clicking on the option that has the logo of the program you've installed, and that ends in the EXE file extension. Then click on Next. Here, if you want to, you can choose to rename your program. Select the name you want, and click on Next. Here, choose I don't want to make another shortcut, and click on Next. Now you will have two links to the program you've just installed. The first link is located on your desktop, and the other link is located within the Play on Linux program. Clicking on either one of these will get the program to launch. Once you launch your program, it should be in full screen. But it depends on the internal settings of the program. And that is how you run Windows programs on Linux. Enjoy!